Lorenzo so Parker not out on track. Pole position is held open. Cody Alberts will have Iman Modak on the inside, but just behind him, that position will be kept open. Wouldn't be surprised if Ian Long does go and uh, indicate to them, listen, you have to keep this spot open. Ahmad Ahmad blowing a fair amount of smoke before he comes off the line. Crazy Harris ahead of uh, Johnson on that inside line. having won the Class E battle in heat number one. Can she do it once again? Ferris Bennett bringing up the tailing of the field. New car driver combination with uh, Ziad Ali for the four of Class X and Mark 1 Golf. So these two new car driver combinations out there. Line, but then the block couldn't go any further. Fell back a couple of positions to uh, 
holes and uh, couldn't get a gap as they went up into Bear Strait. He's looking a lot quicker than the position that he's in right now. But, uh, well, it just hasn't worked out for the first couple of corners. Let's get the hammer down. It's Baby Jakes that's looking good. The leading of the class B cars, the 42 car, they're up in fifth position. Running down the back straight towards at turn five into fast run corner they go. It is Imad and Nias Modak that are sitting first and second. Ahmad Ahmad. He's leading that uh, second group of cars. Here are the two, uh, uh, the two Modaks. Come down towards us, who's now in P1. It is uh, Dias Modak that leads across the line from uh, Imad Modak in that second position, followed by Ahmad Ahmad. Daniel Kutsia sits there on the outside of uh, Cody Albert with a uh, big lockup going down into turn number one. That could have been Vicky Pather that might have locked up there. However, the leaders are working their way out of turn number two. I think that was the third car in Gas B that was Smith that did the lockup going down into holes. But uh, a couple of people that's pushing hard to get through the pack as they work their way down, down towards uh, turn number three. Look at that, it's going to be the two Modaks from Ahmad Ahmad, Cody Alberts, fourth in class A, ahead of Johnson that looked very quick. And Razzie Harris is uh, down in ninth position. So nowhere near where he would like to and where we would expect it to be just ahead of Russian Khan. Uh, we've got somebody slowing right down on the Tigerberg Strait. Cannot see from here who it is. It might be Noel Stunder. I'm not too sure about that. A car's pretty far away from us. The white polo. As uh, they go down into a turn and number five, fast run corner. The two Modak sitting out there in P1 and P2 at this point in time. Yeah, they come down towards us. Through the gearbox they go. As they come up towards us, let's have a look, see who's sitting out there in P1. It is Nias Modak from Imad Modak and here comes Ahmad Ahmad. Ahmad Ahmad trying to split the Modaks as they make their way through turn number one. Alex Johnson is in there with that Red Bull Racing Audi right there with him. We have got uh, Cody Alberts and coming through on the inside of Cody Alberts is Daniel Kutsia. Raxi Harris is in the house as well. So is Baby Jakes and Roshan Khan. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of them in one hell of a fight as they make their way through the king and head into turn three interceptor. Well, contact there with the inside of Alex Johnson by one of the vehicles that came through. And Johnson that was doing very well, in fact, he was up into the front three and uh, he got work towards the outside. He slowed it right down. You'll probably find that he's got a flat wheel or something similar on that motor car. So he was into the tires. Heat number one didn't work through heat number two. But look at this train going down the back main. Russian Khan trying to hold on to that train. It's a long time that ago that we last saw the front end of the pack that, that tight. 1 minute 23.266 Alex Johnson on that last step before the contact with him. But look at this. They're trying to make sure that they don't bust out. But you've got to keep on trucking because there's a whole group of cars behind you. It's the two Modex that are at the front of the pack. Look at this. Razzie Harris has got in. Razzie Harris is in there. He's got Daniel Garcia on the inside line. There is nowhere to go. That can very easily turn to tears. It's just too many cars to a small area. I've in my life never seen anything like this before. Uh, Jad Kalani, have a look at this. There's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's about 12 of them going one on one up to Japan Strait into turn number two. They go now. Working the way out of turn two. It's still the Modak that sits P1 and 2 from here. It looks like it's in Mod Modak. That's out there in P1 from Nias Modak. Daniel Kutsia. He's right up in that third place. And it's Raxi Harris that sits out there in P4. Roshan Khan has made his way through. Ahmad Ahmad's dropped all the way down. Baby Jakes is in there as well. Vicky Paitha has joined that party. Cody Alberts is in there. And Shane Smith, what a fight! Down the back straight towards turn five, fast run. Razzi Harris puts the hammer down and Modak just blasts it up on the inside. Khan doesn't have the same kind of pace as what they've got in the straight line, but he's very quick through the tight bits to the press down into um, fast run corner. They go, can the Modaks hold out the rest of the back and not do two quicker lap times that they bust out of the class? That is the question that's going to be answered. In six laps from now, look at this. They come from underneath the boat, the boat, Mad Max motorcycle bridge, and they're chopping and changing positions. 
Ahmad Ahmad almost into the right rear door of uh, Razzie Harris and uh, it's going to be chaos it's going to happen sooner or later and well it has happened well i said oh Ficky Paith also oh Razzie also door. spins it as well oh, no, he's just uh, behind the building we can't see him from here and then i think it's Ficky Paith though frankly on the exit of turn number one that went off too many cars too small an area Cody Albert third time you've got to watch that in car on camera obviously well, bumpers uh, being shed there, lying on the exit on the outside of turn number two as Raxi Harris uh, pulls the golf off onto the uh, oval track. Oh man, there was 12 of them, you knew it was going to give some time, sooner or later you were hoping it wasn't going to happen. But there was nowhere to go, you can't go three abreast uh, through turn one, it's not going to work. Now, down the back main, who's in P1? It's Daniel Kutsia from Imad Modak in that second place. All of a sudden in P3, it's hey, Baby Jakes. And then Shane Smith sits out there in that fourth place. He's ahead of Ahmad Ahmad. As they roll down the back main, Roshan Khan is on the inside of Cody Alberts as uh, they work their way out of turn five fast run. Cody Alberts right onto the top lip of the uh, exit of fast run corner. Wow, what an amazing place this has been up until now. The first time they've opened up. It's Bodek from Kutsia, from Jacobs, from Smith, Ahmad, Ahmad, Cody Albert's the next man to come through. Russian car, the leading class C car has only got uh, Franco that's also in car, in class C with him a long way down. So he can just go out there and go in that front. He doesn't have to uh, worry whatsoever. So from the two Modaks being right at the front, it's now first and 11th place for the Modaks. Well, it's a whole group of cars coming out of turn number two and there's another group of cars heading going down into turn number one. Hermann is in that group going into turn number one. So was Robert Franco. It's a whole lot. There's about seven, eight, nine of them into that group. But Vicky Pather, that's in that group as well after he ran wide. But Pather sloping right right down. Now, I want to have a look-see because that class E dice will probably be in that lot as well. I do pick up Ryan Lodge in that group. Then it's two cars. Then I see Kiara Fanikak and they are sitting one and two in uh, that class, in class E, as that whole group of cars work their way through the kink and make their way into uh, turn three interceptor. Gordon Harris has got a problem. He's got a major smash up on the front, the right hand side of that golf. Well, the right hand side fender's dropped down and that's dragging on the ground. I think the right rear tyre has gone flat on that other car as well. But uh, completing another lap is Modak Kutsia, uh, Jacobs and Smith. Modak leading out Class A from Ahmad Ahmad and Cody Alberts. That's the only three Class A cars out there. Class B is uh, a Kutsia from Jacobs and uh, Smith finds himself this time in third position in Class. Class C is Russian Khan from Franco. And there's only two of them out there. Class D, I think that is the 39 of Jacobs is the lead car there. And then it is Vicky Pather and then uh, Franco in there behind that. Class E, yes it is large. Then uh, there's two cars and then it's Van Dijk and one class E in uh, the first race. And then for Kale in there behind that. Well, 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 on a rumble. Gary Smith making his way towards uh, turn number two. And then you've got the Devil Thorn, Noel Stunder. Uh, then Robert Franco is in there as well. And then I see... Ryan Lodge, he's just ahead of David Franco going into turn number two with the Kiara Panikarik in that group as well. That's that fight for class D and class E. That's making its way through there as uh, the leading cars carry. I'm trying to pick them up. I've been watching that group of cars going into the receptor corner. I think the leaders will probably taking their way past us uh, pretty soon. Yep, they just came through underneath us now and uh, what a frenetic pace and the number of passing maneuvers. So many cars that have got damage on them and bits and pieces of bodywork that's off. Uh, front uh, bumpers that have uh, disappeared and disintegrated parts that's hanging off numerous motor cars. A lot of uh, guys, three, four cars running around slowly just trying to pick up some points for the day. And uh, while well, the next time the news comes through will be for the uh, last lap of this race. Right, so the leader is going down the back straight. There he goes. That's uh, Neos Modak. 
making his way down the back straight towards turn five. And Imad Modak is out there in that second position. Then here comes Daniel Kutsia. He's got Bailey Jakes right there with him for company. As a good lap of one of the slower goals. Then Cody Alberts is right there. Behind him, Shane Smith and Ahmad Ahmad. Followed there by Roshan Khan and uh, Anwar Levy. Right behind Anwar Levy. We've got a slower car. Then we've got Paul Minnick coming through. Followed there by Valiswan. Wow, I tell you what, what a dice it is. So our lead car as well, Razzie Harris is still working his way around and uh, he worked his way around very slowly. The smoke is starting to come off that front tire now and it looks like the back tire is flat as well, waiting for the white flags as they come down past us. Iman Modak in uh, class A from Cody Alberts, Baby Jackson, Daniel Garcia and Shane Smith in class B. Well, well, that's all happening out there. Heading now towards turn number three is your race leader. The Modaks are sitting P1 and P2. It's a Nias Modak from Imad Modak sitting one and two. Working their way up the Tiger Woods straight towards the turn number three, four. Spark Clinic. We've got a couple of back markers. There's Baby Jakes. Baby Jakes puts her lap on that golf heading down into turn number four into Carke Clinic as you watch the Modax run down the back straight here comes Baby Jakes Baby Jakes and Daniel Kutsia has got Cody Alberts right there with him down the back main it's Daniel Kutsia Cody Alberts one on one down the back main and Shane Smith has caught up to the back end of Ahmad Ahmad and right there with him as well as Roshan Khan as they head into turn five fast run Imad Modak coming up towards the checkered flag minus the year in the bottom front end of that motor car. Baby Jake's second overall. Is it possible? Can you make it to the line? Baby Jake's, wow, can you believe it? A class uh, B car coming through in second overall. So it's Modak from Alberts in class A and then up on up but Baby Jake's from Daniel Garcia and uh, Shane Smith in uh, class B. Class C, Russian Khan from Franco. Class D is probably looking to be the 39 ball that's going to be coming through there in the lead, and that's Anton Jacobs. And then the 69 of David Franco is there behind him, and then the 95 of Gasperi. That would be the Class D battle. The Class E battle, Ryan Lodge, meeting out there on Yara and then the 167 of Kale coming through behind that. Sure, what can I say? Amazing, amazing stuff. Class F, uh, Frita from Vinico. Alright, so the rest of the club must cars. Here comes Ryan Large across the line, and here comes Keanu Vinico, and they will finish first and second in that E class. David Franco was in that group with them as well. And but yeah, class uh, E was won there by Ryan Large with the Keanu Vinico finishing there that second position. Well, Razik Harris determined to finish his race in that uh, very super quick uh, double six golf. Was he falling apart? And uh, I think I yeah. just led to believe that he, because he didn't pull off Gary when he got what we call the Japanese flag, I was just informed here by a Raider man by Tiny that he was a black flag out of the race. Oh, so then you have to pick up some points then. Wow, what an interesting Mike's Place Club and Saloons race number two for the day in these rainy conditions. Still moving 14 entrants out there on circuit. Class A, B, C, D, E, and F. And then Class C, that's a bit thin on the ground. Everybody else, uh, a full complement of cars. Sure, Mike's Place Club and it's going places.